our main event tonight, the Red Corner, Julie Russell. And her opponent fighting out of the blue corner, Abby. Gentlemen, this fight is scheduled for five three-minute rounds. Your referee, Mr. Rob Matrigal. Abby Ewing wearing a black and red trim, while Julie Russell is wearing the gold and black. I think this is going to be a stand-up fight between these two. Touch of gloves? Nope. No touch no of gloves glove touch. two combatants. They want to get to this thing. Abby Ewing Ooh, hard overhand on right, right by Ewing. Another one. A third one. Abby Ewing. These girls are definitely want to trade. Quickly finding a home with that overhand right is Abby Ewing. I'm surprised uh, Ewing shot in on that. She was doing pretty successful with some of those rights. Yeah. I mean, if you saw Abby Ewing, too, she, she had her right hand off of her body, yeah. kind of closing the distance with it. And, right. You know, had uh, pretty good success connecting with three of them. Yumi's got to get her head out of that little neck crank, but I do not think that's going to be super difficult. Uh, Russell needs to capitalize and sweep with that. Yeah, Abby Ewing, you know, there's a lot of experience with it, with uh, Julie Russell on the bottom. And Abby Ewing is taking her time, taking her time right now, which is smart. You know, maybe burn out the arms a little bit of Julie Russell. So Ewing's got her head out of danger there now. Russell's guard is open. It's a little bit of ground to pound from Ewing. She's taking her time, which is smart. I mean, she's a 20-year-old woman, and you're trapping, trying to trap the left arm. She's using. She's doing a nice job of slowly moving up. I think she's having a little bit of trouble with the, the strength of Julia Russell. Yeah. I think also, too, Russell, Russell's position there, well, she just took her foot off the cage, but she's really giving her some pressure to try to get that guard back. I don't know. I can't see if she's working on a Kimura from that side. Um, it looks like a two-on-one. Yeah, I mean, you saw her go for an arm isolation, and uh, yeah. Julie Russell's able to take uh, Oh, she's going to the punches now. Heavy left hands. I'm not sure why she backed off of that. She's successful on those three lefts. Russell's got to get out of there. She's in, getting some danger. She needs to turtle out. I'll tell, you what, up. I'll tell you what, one of the big issues that Julie Russell's having is the length of Abby Ewing. I think so. Abby Ewing is a young woman with a bright future. Madrigal's yeah. really keeping an eye on this. He looks like he's getting... Yeah, there's, there's a lot of experience with yeah. Julia Russell, though. I mean, she's had a James Crouch shoot that just like that. Maybe Abby Ewing at is the on here. She's got to do something about this. And Julia Russell trying to scramble. Russell needs to try to, to get up off of her knees and try to create some of that downward pressure on, on Ewing to slide her off the top. Staying in that position is only going to get her in more danger. Yeah. And Julie Russell is doing a pretty good job defending up until this point. Turn back in. T ten seconds to survive this. Can she do it? I think we're going to see a second round. I think you're right. Wow. I'm going to tell you this right Great now. First round. Abby, or Abby Ewing in her first fight, it was a controversial loss in her hometown. Yeah. Abby Ewing is no stranger to adversity and dealing with issues in a fight. Yeah, she uh, certainly brought it to Russell there. Very dominant first round for her. She doesn't look to be breathing heavy at all. Yeah, Julie Russell catching her breath in between rounds. Yeah. Russell did take a lot of damage in there. She's breathing a little heavy. We'll see if some of her experience can help her come back from that first round. Yeah, Grant Dawson, I mean, they're having a conversation. Like, you see the conversation taking place between uh, Julie and Grant? Yeah. You can see Madrigal kind of keeping an eye on uh, Yeah, you know, there's a, lot of, there's a lot of experience with Julie. Like, yeah. I, I get where he's taking an eye, and he's aware of it. Yeah. You know, somebody like Rob Madrigal's not going to... Right. Be going in there not understanding what competitors were. Or who they are and what they're capable of. Got Abby Ewing, Julie Russell, center cage. See, Andy, Abby Ewing is leading with her right hand. She's throwing hard. 
Left, right, left. He's throwing everything behind those. And I'll tell you what, Julie Russell cannot take too many, too many more of those. Good double leg takedown by Abby Ewing. Yeah, Ewing with the takedown again. I, I, you know, the reaction of Julie Russell taking the uh, punches from Abby Ewing is very telling of Abby's power. Absolutely. She seemed definitely stunned by those. Um, Russell's got to really work to put her back on the cage and try to get to a standing position from here and turn this around. She does not want to lay underneath here and take punches for the rest of this round. It's going to pretty much seal her fate. No, I, I agree. I agree. Yeah, the length of Abby Ewing is uh, very difficult to deal with, and she yeah. uses it to her advantage. She definitely does. She's doing a great job with and, it. And, you know, we've seen the fighters earlier tonight that had the length that weren't using it to their advantage. Absolutely. And, and Absolutely. Abby certainly is... Uh, it looks like advantage. Julie Russell might be looking for a Kimura there. She might even have it locked up. And uh, Ewing is defending off of it. She's got to be careful that she doesn't get her arm separated from her body there. Even if she's passing in there. Yeah, Abby Ewing's trying to pass to uh, full mount. And it looks like she's off of that Kimura. Yeah. And, yeah. and just like that, Abby Ewing, once again, is in a dominant position. Raining down punches. Oh. On Julie Russell. Julie Russell not defending too well from there. She's got to do something. Maybe Ewing looking for. She's got her, Ewing flattening her out. A lot of unanswered punches there. Russell's got to get moving here. The frustration of Julie Russell must be at an all-time high right now. Yeah. I mean, she's, she's not quitting. She keeps moving no, from she's, position to position. I mean, she's definitely game, for, game to fight. She's just in some rough spots here. Yeah, there's a discernible amount of talent between the two, but Julie Russell, Julie Russell is is putting up a fight. She certainly is. A lot of people would have tapped to that a long time ago. I mean, it's, we've got an entire Midwest refusing to fight Abby Ewing for a reason. Right. And Julie Russell's weathering the storm. Yeah. You can see she's not looking to go out anytime easily. No, and she's blocking. You know. Got to protect her neck there. Ewing's attacking. And, and like Abby Ewing, have her pretty that's tight. in. That's in. I think Julie Russell, and listen to the educated crowd. Listen to this educated crowd on their toes right now. I going to get out of that. It looks pretty solid. And Russell's not giving up, though. She's she's still awake. She's still pushing away. Madrigal trying to keep an eye on her. Uh, I think she's going to go out on her shield. There she, she is. Wow. And Julie Russell, let me tell you something about the heart that's of Julie right. Russell. She came here to fight. I she have got did. a ton of respect for that woman. And Abby Ewing uh, put out a clinic. That woman right there, Abby Ewing, has got a very bright future in mixed martial arts. She certainly does. She showed a really complete game. Great striking, great takedowns, great jiu-jitsu. I mean, she, Julie Russell was willing to go out on her shield. I mean, she didn't get a lot of offense off, but I'm going to tell you this right now. The heart of that woman is uh, just... Yeah, something I to be said for. I don't think anybody can question the heart of Julie Russell after. And, and Abby you know, Ewing uh, uh, put out a clinic. Uh, that woman right there, Abby Ewing, has got a very bright future in mixed martial arts. She certainly does. She showed a really complete game. Great striking, great takedowns. And Abby Ewing uh, uh, put out a clinic. That woman right there, Abby Ewing, has got a very bright future in mixed martial arts. She certainly does. She showed a really complete game. Great striking, great takedowns. Great jiu-jitsu. I mean, Julie Russell was willing to go out at her shield. And, and Abby Ewing...